Hey guys, today we are back with some more solo leveling. The last episode, we did see a reunion with the squad that took on that traumatic dungeon. And I'm honestly surprised to see their faces once again. I know if that was me, I would have never saw a dungeon a day in my life after that event. Uh, we saw that they were low on members, so they are working with some convicts. I definitely don't trust them. Or that purple hair guy, I'm pretty sure his name was Kang. I mean, he seems nonchalant, but like, that's just not a good sign. <laughs> you feel me? But let's jump right into it. Damn. Oh, hold on, look at him. He got the nunchucks on him. Wait, the convicts are low-key dirty. Oh, shit. Yeah, they are not to be played with. Hey, my boy Song still got in. Something like for Jin Woo. If it was back in the day, he would be getting whooped by that goblin. Oh yeah, that aura. See enough. It's way better than before. See, like he just keeping an eye on him. I do not trust him at all. That's so sick. You know, the system was a blessing. Alright, he's going for the boss. Still eyeing him down, bro. With a little smirk. I do not trust that bastard whatsoever. Nah, he's still violating. Come on. I guess they don't know what he's truly about. Oh, for the past? Yeah, they left him there to die. The weakest one. He's really the strongest in that moment. Respect. I'm glad that he's acknowledging that. Mm, it's the convicts. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Fuck him up, Kang. Come on. They could go to hell. Got that man by the collar. Oh, yeah. Now he's on it. Oh, my God. Wait, 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 wait. Chill. Chill on the companions. Oh, no. They're about to get fucked up too. Oh, he was the guy that pulled up with him. I forgot about that. No. He got slammed. No, Mr. Kim. You got family. You can't die here, brother. Oh, he's. It's, it's raps. This is crazy because even his wife was like warning him like it's dangerous to be a hunter or go on these dungeons. He should listen. They should have came back, man. And he wants to show him, give like a proper apology too. Oh, there's a bastard. Oh! To say Juhi! That motherfucker is quick. Oh my god, look at his, like, facial expression. He was so nonchalant, now he's got that evil grin to him. Oh man. Hey, he is a swordsman. The one armed swordsman. About to pop a blood vessel. Oh. What is that? It's like a. The fuck is that ability? Shit's dirty. Oh no, not one of these! Ah! Okay, Juhi got that auto heal on though. 
He good. Uh -oh. Hey, so go with that! Stop playing with him! Come on! Oh shit. Oh my god, that motherfucker's moving! Can't even see him. Oh shit. Don't die on me, Mr. Song. She's a juice. Damn. Jinwoo, step in, please! Oh. Ooh. He baited him. Oh, he too quick, though. Cunning gold fuck. No. That motherfucker Jinwoo, baby. Let's go. Let's see you cook, my brother. Hey, don't worry, Mr. Song. He is not the same Jim Wu as before. He got it. Ooh, he's got that glow in his eye. He's not playing. Is he still like a second awakener? Isn't it like there's a different term for him, right? He's like one of a kind. He got the dual wheel now. That man's on demon time. He trying to catch a body. Like you already caught five. Yeah. Exactly. Because then they were ratted potentially in the future. He tortured them. Jeez. What bastard. <laughs> That smirk. This is what he does. He thrives off killing people, looks like. Oh, yeah, look at the face. Gosh. <laughs> Holy fuck, this guy's devious. Oh, he weaving all of them. Yo, this is a fire-ass fight. They're so quick. Don't got that experience. Oh my god, they're just bouncing off each other. Oh, you used the little Santa advantage. Mm. You got that dark aura. <laughs> He's talking to him so calmly. Yep. Now the system's saying, pack him up! Pack him up! You don't know about that. You're about to find out real soon. Oh! He's doing the little uh, Goku warm-up! Man. R.I.P. Toriyama. Literally one of the GOATs. You know, he had so much influence. Amazing. I remember playing the games growing up. Oh, that poison kicking his ass. Oh! Oh, Jim Wu on that! He on his ass! Oh. Zuma. What? So this guy's invisible? Nah, nah this guy's like... Top of the top assassin. This ability's dirty. Oh! Took out his ankle. Hey, that's about to change right here, though. <laughs> Dude, he's not even panicking. He got this in the bag. He one of a kind. <laughs> that boy is so cold, bruh. He's moving without a worry in the world. You can't see the eyes or nothing. Murderous intent. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell? This shit like a domain. <laughs> what? Just like that? 
You got that man staring right in your soul. Just like that? This was staring back at you. You know, Jim Wu is such a nice guy. I don't see him becoming like a dark dude. But maybe potentially. Did he get the stealth ability? What was that? Runestone stealth. Okay. I'm looking forward to that. Oh shit, he might lose himself actually. He's speaking like that. So he did assume that maybe someone was up. I wonder if he assumes now something's up with him. Let's go! They both slide in for Jin Woo. I mean, yeah, Kang was hella nice. Uh, I mean, Woo is definitely suspicious. He might come back to this moment in the future. Especially when assuming something about Jin Woo. Oh, he are A rank. He nice. Good thing he was on the mission. You're a real ass dude. I love Mr. Song. Oh, that's a shard that they got from the mission, right? That episode was sick, seeing the fight between Kang and Jim Wu. And you know when Jim Wu was just looking over the top of him after he hit him with that like domain murderous intent move? Like, he really reminded me of that statue with the good old stare, you feel me? I guess now we wait till Saturday to see what the next episode is all about. I heard that the upcoming episodes to close out this season are really good, so I'm looking forward to that. I appreciate all of you guys for watching, and I'll catch all of you in the next one. Peace out.